My name is Bob Yi. I'm a member of the board of, board of the Palm Springs uh, Navy League, and I'm here to do an interview with Edward Weiss, who is on the USS Tennessee during World War II, and he will be presenting uh, how, what the Tennessee and what he did during the bombardment of Kiska in the Aleutians. You may start. You ready? Yeah. Oh. When we came back from uh, Pearl Harbor, and we went to Bremerton, and we had got the unnecessary repairs, and, uh, and then we were ready uh, for uh, for action. So we uh, sailed to, to Kiska up in Alaska uh, because uh, the Japanese had landed there. And we went on up with a, a battle group and um, a full complement of troops for uh, transport with troops. <coughs> and so we got up there, we went through, to get up there, we went, uh, we were up on the northern side, but we went uh, uh, west to, and, and through the uh, Bering Straits and up uh, on the other side of the island. And so, like I say, we were on the north side, and we uh, we bombarded uh, Kiska for uh, overnight, uh, all day and overnight. Uh, there was, I think there was maybe about three battleships. I don't know which ones they were, but the Tennessee uh, was one of them. Yeah. So then uh, one morning, the next morning, they. Um, had the landing uh, um, the landing crews uh, made their boats and loaded up with the um, uh, soldiers or marines and they went ashore and we gave them uh, ashore protection we were close and uh, um, so then they um, they went ashore and, and they they found nothing. They found some fires burning and some coffee pots still on the fire and a few dogs running around. The Japanese, they, 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 they uh, abandoned during the night on submarines. And so there was nothing to Kiska. And after Kiska, we, we sailed on to, to our next operation. 